Hey everyone, this is Wicked Cushions and today I'm going to show you how to replace the ear pads on your Sony MDR-1000. Sony has three models of this line of headphones which is the MDR-1000, WH-1000XM2 and WH-1000XM3. The way you replace the ear pad on all three models is the exact same way. The ear pad has six hooks on the back of it and they click inside six corresponding slots that are located on the headphone ear cup. The first step will be to remove the ear pad. Simply grab a butter knife and gently shove it from the side of the ear pad. Raise the knife to the opposite side until you hear a clicking sound. After you hear the sound, simply hold the ear pad from within and pull it to the opposite side. These are the six hooks and their corresponding slots that I was talking about previously. A common complaint that we have been getting about the MDR-1000 is that they simply hurt after a long listening period. When we tested them, the first thing we saw immediately was that the ear pads are extremely thin and have an extremely narrow opening. With our replacement, we solved these two problems by adding a thick layer of foam and expanding the inner dimension of the ear pad. These two improvements are going to allow you to take your Sony 1000 to the level of comfort it deserves, a level that will match the awesome sound that these headphones produce. Now let's get back to installing these ear pads. While there is no left and right on these ear pads, they do have a top and bottom. You will be able to recognize which side is the bottom by looking for this small circle that I am showing you right now. Now we are going to align the hooks on the ear pad to the slots on the ear cup. We are going to start from the top and then work your way around the ear pad. You will simply push the hook into the slot until you hear a clicking sound. And then you're going to follow around the ear pad until you get all six hooks down. Try to remember the approximate position of the hooks. You can simply look at the other ear pad and look at its backside and go and push at that specific location. It doesn't have to be the exact same location, but just around it until you hear a clicking sound. When you are done, make sure that the ear pad is firmly in place. If not, it means that one of the hooks is not connected. Just go around and push it back into its place. Now we are going to do the same exact thing on the other side. Just make sure to notice which side is the bottom and we are done. I hope this video is helpful and I hope you get to enjoy your upgraded Sony 1000 headphones.